Okay, this is called a standing partner med ball toss. I don't have a partner with me, but in vision I have one right out in front of me where the camera is facing directly back towards me. <clears throat> you can make this movement more challenging by creating more distance between the partners and then obviously elevating the weight on the med ball. But in this case, we're gonna be standing facing one another. I'm gonna grab this med ball and I'm gonna hold it like a, um, this is called like a basket toss, right? We're here, I'm gonna go on my right hip. I'm going to reach back, let my trunk rotate as much as I can and I'm gonna to toss it to the right side of the partner. So we're going in this kind of like diagonal toss. They're going to focus on, imagine I was this partner, they're gonna focus on catching the ball from me, decelerating it, accelerating it, and passing it back to my same side. So in this case, my partner's gonna be out in front of me, we're gonna go right side to right side for the set prescribed reps, and then we'll go left side to left side. The other way you can do a standing partner med ball toss, depending on how it's prescribed, is we can face this way to where our sides, our lateral sides are facing the partner. And in this case, we can rotate, toss, rotate, toss back and forth. So in this case, this partner would be catching on the left side, tossing. Me would be catching on the right side, tossing. And we'll be going for the set prescribed reps that the coach prescribes to you. Depending on, we might coach you on rotating that back leg or keeping the legs stiff and stable. But regardless, we're working on decelerating the trunk in rotation and then accelerating it out. That is the standing med ball toss.